All right, guys, so you heard AGOG Elsa introduce us. Um, we have been to the thrift store recently, and we have lots of goodies to show you. So we kind of compiled all of the non-American Girl-related things, and then we're going to also be recording an American Girl video, so look for that coming soon. But we wanted to show you some of the goodies we've gotten lately, and AGOG Elsa is in love with some of them. So the first one is this palace pet. Mm -hmm. who belongs to Sleeping Beauty, so that's Dreamy. And then we got this very large Minnie Mouse plush, and AGOG Elsa loves Minnie Mouse, so she is super excited for her. All right, now talking about some of the other goodies we got. One of the first things we got was this bag of Build-A-Bear shoes. And so we have a couple Build-A-Bears here at our house, and we are currently into Hello Kitty. So we're pretty excited to open those and play with those. We'll go ahead and leave those on camera. Hey, GOG Elsa is playing with the stuffed animals. All right, get the largest thing out of the bag here. So we found this animators, Disney Animators Collection Cinderella. And we just thought she was really pretty and we thought we'd fix her up a little bit. And she was $2.99. I forgot to show you. Um, the stuffies, I don't remember the price because we watched those and she's been playing with them. Um, but the bag of Build-A-Bear shoes was $1.99. Okay. Also, um, this wasn't at the same store, but we got this really pretty Barbie. And she is wearing a GOG Elsa's favorite color, purple and pink. And we paid $2.99 for her. All right, so also we got this bag of Build-A-Bear clothes, and you can see it says right there, Build-A-Bear Workshop, and this one was $1.99 as well, and since it's been a while, I don't remember what was on sale and what wasn't, but like I said, we usually just wash these and play with them for a while, and once we get tired of them, we move on. So the next stuff that I found was all... Um, from Unique, and I did pay, pay full price, but um, the full price was $5.99, and you guys can see, I think this is New Moon Jacob, I'm not sure. I could be wrong, it could be Breaking Dawn, I'm not really sure, but he's got his sneakers on, and he's got his um, pants, or his shorts, I should say, and the tattoo. So, he does have soft hair, it's not a plastic piece, so... That's kind of a nice touch, um, but since we are not into Twilight dolls, we will be selling him. So, yeah. Then we got, this is somebody that AGOG Elsa is very excited about, Claudine Wolf. And I, again, do not know which wave is what. Um, we've seen some of the movies, but I haven't seen all of them. But she is in really nice condition. Her hair needs a little brush, but her makeup is beautiful. She does have her dress. It looks like she's probably missing some accessories and things like that. Um, doesn't have any earrings or bracelets or necklaces. So I don't know. Maybe she came without them, but I doubt it, considering Monster High usually does. And then these adorable purple shoes. So this is our second Claudine. I'm pretty excited to add her to our collection. And AGOG Elsa is very excited about her. Okay, and next is another $5.99 bag. And it did come with this Barbie. And this Barbie, just to warn you, is very, very beat up. Her paint is, like, completely gone. So she really needs um, to be painted again. And you can see, oh, look at her poor face. Wow. Some kid brutalized this Barbie. So um, I think given her condition, I'm not even going to try and clean her up. I'll probably just donate her again. Um, and hopefully somebody who's better equipped for this can take her on, especially somebody who really likes Barbies. So, that was that doll. And then, the reason why I got this bag was for the second Claudine Wolf. And she does, um, this looks like the sports pack, I believe from reviews I saw online that she's supposed to have like a bubble gum because she does have that open mouth. And so I'm pretty sure that's correct, but I could be wrong. She does have earrings 
and her hat, which is very cute. Uh, it does not look like it comes off, or if it does, I just am not pulling hard enough, so we'll see. You can see she is missing a hand, but she does have her complete outfit, including these cute little shoes and socks. So I thought she was just really cute. I mean, like, she is missing a couple of things, but we will um, fix that up in a little while. Apparently, H-E-O-G-L says making a wave at you all. So, um, we'll get her fixed up a bit, but I just thought she was super cute, and for $3, that was a good price. And A-G-O-G Elsa is taking everything off screen, I'm sorry. Um, also, just lying around on, um, on the shelf, and they did not charge me for it because it was not even close to a bag or anything, so I would have put it with it. I found this dress, which I'm pretty sure is from Operetta, because we have an Operetta in this dress. So that's kind of a cool find, and especially since I didn't have to pay for it, I thought that was really cool. Then this last bag is kind of just a jumble grab bag of stuff. It was half price, so it was $2. I did not pay the full $3.99 um, because most of this stuff I was not interested in and will either be redonating or reselling to kind of offset some of my costs here. So, yeah, not into that frisbee. We have this. Chick-fil-A game, which we got a bunch of from um, Chick-fil-A Kids Meals. A water gun. Again, not interested in this. Uh, this one has one of these, and I remember this from AGOG Elsa being little. It goes into like a little music box guy that she loved, but she is too big for it now. Then we got Joy from Inside Out. Just a second. And we just think she's super cute. And AGOG Elsa has been waiting very patiently for us to open this so you guys could see and so she could play with it. Also in this bag came a little... Oh, poor hair. Yikes. I'm going to have to definitely take care of this doll's hair. But this is a strawberry shortcake doll. And you can barely see her face through all the hair. Okay, I apologize. Um, we had an interruption. So I think this is a strawberry shortcake doll given the color pattern, but she's not in the best of condition. <laughs> and then let's see. Some other little random things. This horse. And um, it's got kind of an unusual paint job with the red nostrils. So I don't know what we'll do with that. I'm um, not something that. She seems to be interested in, not something I'm interested in either. This looks like it came off of this poor little guy, and I think this is a Precious Moments. It looks like an ornament. So I'll probably be trying to glue it back together, and um, I know some people that are into them. So I'll probably just give that to the friend that likes Precious Moments, since I am not personally very... Oh, it actually looks like his head stays on. Nope, I lied. All right, and then this looks like... Oh, this is a Zoom Zoom. Um, I forget who this was. I think we got it once. So it's really cute. I didn't know this was in here. It was kind of buried under all the other things. So it's a cute little zoom zoom, and you can see AGOG Elsa is going to take that from me because she looks pretty excited about it. But the real reason why I bought this bag, and I couldn't see her fully, is for this Shoppy. Um, I don't know much about Shoppies, but AGOG Elsa loves Shopkins, and I just thought she was pretty cute, and considering she was $2, and they're pretty expensive in general, can you wait until I'm done, please? Um, she is missing a shoe, as you can see, but she is pretty darn cute. Um, she's got a little cute bracelet, and the kind of cute face mold that they do, a little bit big eyes in my opinion, but whatever, kind of different, and then she's got some string holding on this kind of headband to deal with a braid. Um, if you guys know who this is, please feel free to comment below. I will be looking it up online, so please forgive my lack of knowledge, but she is really cute, and I just thought um, AGOG Elsa would like her since she has Bubblesha already and thought she might think she was fun. So, this was our haul for our assortment of thrift store finds. And AGOG Elsa has taken over the Monster High Dolly, so they were there. So if you guys would please um, give us a thumbs up if you are enjoying our thrift store videos. And also, if you would please write in the comments below, what was your favorite thing we got? 
and anything else that you want us to know. We hope you will please give this video a big, huge thumbs up, comment, rate, and subscribe, and we hope you have a fabulous day. Bye, guys!